While some of India's Hindu majority might not like to admit it, Islam has had an enormous influence on the country's national character, its culture, its food and its architecture. Every Friday, this 17th century district bursts into life at Jama Masjid, India's largest mosque. Later that evening, I visit an ancient shrine called Nizamuddin. There are many different kinds of Muslims in India, and among the most intriguing are the Sufis, renowned for their music. For seven generations, the same family have been the shrine's musicians and spiritual guides. The Sufis are mystics who use music to attain a trance-like state. Capturing and holding the attention of the gathering is the art of the Sufi musician. I didn't fall into a trance, but I did feel strangely compelled to part with some cash. performance, I caught up with the youngest member of the troupe, as he and his friends relaxed over a game of Karen. The cafe was a bit shady, and I'd heard that this was not a safe place for non-Muslims to be after dark. But there wasn't the slightest hint of any tension, and they invited me to join them for a game. I used to play when I was a kid. It's a bit like uh, pool, I suppose, or, or snooker or something like that. Um, actually, closer to pool, because uh, the first colour that you put in, that's your colour. You have to put the same colours in, so much like pool. Future make up plans, Oh, that's nice. Uh, that's good. While we played, Shadab told me a bit more about himself. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. In terms of ambition, it's just one to further his, further his father's name, so the family name goes on. Um, he's been learning from his father, uh, singing and all that stuff for about 14 years, so it starts when he was 10. He would like to kind of do his own singing thing maybe at some point. But at this stage, because his father and his grandfather are still singing, it's uh, still being part of that whole uh, uh, thing. But I think it's my turn. Anybody? No, it's my turn. No! No! They come once or twice a week here whenever they get the chance. And uh, chilled out, lived in this part, always lived in Delhi, born in Delhi. So, uh, oh, that's bad. That was bad. Sorry. Huh? No! I was sort of trying to make it. 